videos. But I thought I would give Hungry Root a try. This is my third delivery. Um, it comes in this insulation stuff, which uh, it seems such a waste. I was going to honestly save it and insulate my chicken coop with it. And these big ice packs. And I haven't had a chance to try the oatmeal yet. But it comes with a lot of pre-made but the thing is, is you don't really get to pick. You just kind of get what comes. And mango cultured coconut cream. Hmm, that sounds promising. Um, I canceled it today. Not because so much I don't like it. But I'm running into the issue. These are kohlrabi noodles. That... Uh, brown rice queen. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Uh, every order that I've ordered, these things are, are yummy. These mixes that they send, and you can mix them in salads for even more stuff. There's a garlicky chickpea and a taco one. Um, but I've, I've tried to customize and select stuff, and it doesn't come. Uh, I've checked three times now to try their garlic parmesan sauce. Let's see if it finally came. Oh, it finally came. Garlic parmesan, dairy free. Let's see, what's this? The tofu bites. I tried the yuba noodles. Those were a little chewy. Uh, but I mean, I guess tahini ginger yuba noodles I tried them in a fake like alfredo and it wasn't too bad um, this cashew cheddar I have not tried yet some more veggie or carbless noodles and some mushroom chicken meatballs so I got this cookbook in the beginning and my problem is is I get all of these random ingredients and sauces and then let's see let me get them all up there so this is one week's worth of stuff that costs ninety dollars with shipping that's the large box they say they will make like five two-person meals but I was kind of expecting some set meals that I could just that would have the ingredients separated with the recipe ready and I'm basically having to Flip back through uh, my emails on what I was sent. Try and match it up with, I got one recipe box in the beginning. So I have to try and match up what ingredients I got with what, try and dig through and find the recipe in here. So these advertising it takes five to 10 minutes to make something isn't really, I mean this is like bragging like six minutes, five minutes, you know, but it's not because you have to dig through find what they sent you and then find the stuff and then try and match it up with the recipe and there's nothing that says really uh, what like with the shaved brussels or the salad mixes like how much of each to use so I mean with the sauces it'll tell you you know like one or two tablespoons but it wasn't bad you know my problem isn't really so much with them like one this is kind of more expensive it's not time saving it hasn't been time saving for me so much because I'm having to dig and figure out each recipe because when I work 12 13 hour shifts I just don't have the time to cook 
really good meals and uh, so I was looking for something alternative to coming home after a 13 hour shift and saying we're going to Subway because we're, I'm so tired. So I was really trying to find something on my 12 hour shift days that was healthier, that was quicker to make. And if you could plan it out and like have a printout of what you'd ordered and matched it up with the recipes, it probably would work better. You know, it's definitely a, you gotta get used to the taste of the stuff. Like for me, I still have not fully detoxed from sugar. And so your taste buds get better when you once you get off of stuff and once you get on something like this. It definitely tastes better once you're detox from sugar and processed foods. But unfortunately for Hungry Root, they the FedEx, I've given it three times now, and every time my order has been two to three days late. And I don't understand it, they don't understand it. Because FedEx is getting it in the morning at four in the morning and then I don't get it for two or three days after because Monday through Friday I work so I set my deliveries for Saturday well it's in the truck for delivery on Saturday but I never get it they're not delivering on Sunday so I end up getting my order Monday so this one came today Monday at it's seven o'clock at night it has been in their truck since 4 a.m. this morning an hour north of me and I just got it today and it was actually supposed to be here Saturday so again it's two days late you know, which is fine because some of them have like a couple days, you know, two weeks. I think some of them, some of them only have a couple days to use. Some of them have like two weeks because it's fresh stuff. But once it warms up and once it starts getting hotter, that's not going to work sitting for two days, extra days in the heat. So unfortunately, I canceled for now, but... If I had better planning and time, I could probably buy a lot more for $90 than that. Um, from the store, well, obviously. And, you know, I say, I guess, give it a try. You at least get the recipe book that you can save. And I would really like to figure out they their chickpea, ch like, co chocolate cookie dough was amazing so like I said normally I do fish vi fish videos fish unboxing but we are going to be once a month here trying different dinner plan things till I find one that works for me as an RN working like I said a 13 hour shift I get home at 4 p.m. I need to have something healthy and decent that I can make quickly for my family and then get to bed because I got to be back at three in the morning the next day so if anybody else has tried any of the ones like our, our I think our next one we're gonna be trying is uh, I'm not sure if it was well there's so many there's hello fresh blue apron dinnerly I really would like to find one that's more healthy organic type but if anybody else has tried any of these and, and wants to comment, feel free to comment. Thanks.